um, previously we have uh, created 3D semantic part cloud for the uh, set images and now we will uh, create semantic part cloud for sweet pepper plant of course uh, we have to train uh, the sweet pepper plant to get a, uh, a weight and I already uh, trained a weight here uh, you can later download them to use um, I already uh, upload uh, our program to github so you can uh, download the way here and the scott we also download from github and we don't have to upload to driver every single code uh, and i will make a uh, multi versions first to follow the our lessons um, so uh, firstly we will create a new uh, python file to predict the sweet pepper plant parts um, open the script folder and we create new the sweet pepper topic yeah it's uh, really the same as the sub topic we did not change anything we just changed the number of class uh, in uh, this training model we have a six class and we changed the, the link to the uh, weight and when you download your code please remember to change the link here because I enter here is the the absolute path so you must change okay uh, just like that uh, it's, it's really similar to the previous file and um, we also create new CPP file here it's 3D sweet pepper CPP uh, and uh, in this link um, in this file we uh, also do not change anything okay do not change anything we uh, get the semantic we get the depth image and we pass into the uh, create semantic or cloud it's, it's it's really the same and we will create a new Notes here is 3D sweet pepper notes. A link to the file 3D sweet pepper dot cpp. We link the library, okay. And then we run a uh, catkin make to build a new note. And after building, you will count the note. For example, I will um, stop. I will count the service server um, like the the AI topic, the the AI node, the semantic segmentation node to convert the RGB image to semantic image. I will start it first and then i will um this this not will publish the rgb image depth image and semantic image and in our application we only get semantic and depth uh, you can verify it by using rv We can see the topic. We have a semantic topic here. Okay. But now we didn't publish the um, RGB image from the cameras. And in this example, we will run the trust back 
fire. I already saved your fire from oh clay oh opening fires. I don't know, maybe I don't know why it has arrows. Ah, because it, it does not exist. Uh, when I copy, I uh, remove. So I will copy back. Wait a minute. Read image back. Backfire. Copy. Okay. Okay, finish. Again, I will try to play the back files. You can get the back files in GitHub. So you can see when I publish the RGB image, you will get the 70 image here. Yeah. Okay. And now I will start the uh, notes. Our uh, Rose Run. Okay, I will write down. Rose Run read image back. Rich image back 3D sweet pepper not and it will appear our semantic but semantic image I will start another file for you to easy to see because of this file we have a moving uh, moving camera. Okay. Our program is now suitable for um, not moving camera. Uh, when moving camera, we should use the uh, we should use RB Slam to combine the images I will run it others okay now let's start again this is the 3d bug out and we don't use the yeah, it's close so we have a RGB image here we have a semantic image here okay and this is the 3d pod cloud and we run the back file this back file is a capture the sweet pepper but the camera stand at the same position it doesn't move in previous uh, example the camera is moving so that is our example to we just change the weight and when we change the RGB image we have a sweet paper semantic point cloud so if you want to create any semantic point cloud of any objects of other objects uh, please remember to change the weight okay uh, that's all for this example. Next, we will uh, using RB Slam to uh, combine the many uh, different RGB images. Or um, it's like a moving camera.